something happened in that jungle that set you on a whole new path, and it was this. I mean, I had no idea. Seriously, no I, idea. Because, well, if I'd have known, I'd have done it years before. But because a lot of women have gone on the show since, and I would say have tried to do a Mylene. Would you agree with that? Yeah. I say all, all yeah, credit there's, to there's them. There's been some swimwear moments that have definitely had you in there thinking. I remember the papers going nuts with this when everybody still read papers. Look how high my boobs were then. I know. They were well bouncy, babe. <laughs> <laughs> and then you had children. Yeah, and um, then I breastfed. <laughs> <laughs> but, but that, for me, is the moment that you became Myling Class Inc. It's an interesting one, because when I came out of the jungle... Um, Weirdly, as I said, I don't really cook, but I had been given the job of making the rice. David Guest, rest his soul, didn't trust anyone to divvy up the portions. So he said, I vote Mylene to do it. So I made rice morning, noon, night. Probably and the just, last time you cooked, if we're being probably honest. Probably the last time. But that was my job. So I thought if I was going to come out with anything, if it's going to be a rice commercial. <laughs> um, but I came out and it was all about this white bikini, which wasn't very white by the time I left. It was so muddy, dirty and grubby. But I couldn't believe it. And the offers that came through as a, a result of that um, from modelling contracts um, initially just staggering you know if, if it works for another girl I say jump in the shower jump in right now it's freezing but get in why not why not 